He was born on the 16th of September 1915 in the city of Isonyi. It is today called Isonyi, close to Ijebu Moshi in Ogun State, Nigeria. His name is Alpheus Taiwo Olunaike, the man you call Alajo Shomolu. Alpheus Taiwo Olunaike was just three years old when he lost his father. However, he was able to proceed in his education. He started his primary education at the Emmanuel Primary School, Ijebu Isonyi. He had not finished his education at this small hamlet when his paternal uncle, S.T.A. Torimori, came and took him to Lagos, where he was able to further his education. Therefore, when the young brother of his late dad, S.T. Torimori, was going to Cameroon on a commercial trip, Baba Alajo Shomolu decided he would also seize the opportunity to follow him too. Alpheus Taiwo Olunaike Alajo Shomolu was on his way to Paul Bia's nation and in 1950, a life career is about to begin. In Cameroon, one of his neighbors was a thrift collector and he gisted him about business which immediately caught his fancy. Upon returning to Nigeria, he created his own copy of the cards and he named his own venture Popular Daily Alajo Shomulu. At the peak of his career, he was very hardworking and very diligent. He never forget things, he knows everybody by name and can also tell their home addresses and their next of kin even if he was woken from a sleep. One can easily say that the history of banking in Nigeria is incomplete without the mention of Alpheus Taiwo Olunaike. After establishing his popular daily Alajo Shomolu thrift collection business, he bought a bicycle to enable him move around as he collects money for savings from his customers. At the peak of his career, he was so hardworking and diligent at his work that saints were coined in his name, such as Yes, it is true. One sold his car to buy a rally bicycle to enable his business move faster. One very interesting thing is that many people actually think the story of Alajo Shomolu is a myth, a legend, or that it never existed. It did truly exist. But Alajo Shomolu's popularity and prosperity grew so much, he built his first house at number 10, Odunoka Street in Ijesha. He later sold the house to the Deeper Life Ministry and built another one at, at Olong Kemi Wotutu area by Riga Lagos. In a short while, his film spread like wildfire. He was the thrift collector to the entire axis of Awolo Market, Onyego Market, Olaleye, Maltu, Ojuoye, Babalosa, Sangros, and of course Shomolu, where he was where he got the nickname Alajo Shomolu. His customers fell in love with him. He was diligent and truthful. He was happily married. At the time he was alive, he was the lay reader and treasurer for 30 years at the Anglican Church where he attended at Shomulu. Baba Alajo Shomulu continued his job with joy until 2010 when he was 95 years old. He then retired. On 11th of August 2012, Baba Alajo Shomulu passed on. Alpheus Taiwo Olunaike Baba Alajo Shomulu The Yoruba Nation is proud of you. Emma,